With the weather changing to welcome the cooler seasons, we are all a little under the weather. Hi, I'm Dr. Amrita and you are listening to the Health Wealth Rich Podcast. Any health information I share here is only for educational purpose. You must consult a doctor for medical opinion. I may be a little hoarse today, so bear with me. Good news first. My podcast is now available on Amazon Music. Now, recovering from a cold needs a lot of tender, loving care. The trouble happens when all of us catch it at once. I'm reading a book called The Plant Paradox by Dr. Stephen R. Gundry. It's giving me a lot of food for thought. Once I test the things which we, he has mentioned, I will definitely tell you all about it. I will be happier talking about food and stuff once I check the signs behind it. He has a lot of proof, but you know, the proof of the pudding is definitely in the eating. And there are so many nutrition books everywhere and the nutrition signs seems to be very sketchy with every passing year and what we thought was right 10 years back seems to be all debunked now. I'm using an amazing hyaluronic acid uh, for my skin. It's by Nika Skin Rx, Nika's own brand and uh, it's really very good for my skin especially when it's this dry season I want a hydrating serum and this one is quite good. Falguni Nair is the woman behind this e-commerce venture and incidentally Nika today made its stock market debut. Now on to some interesting health news. Some days back a 60 year old male patient came to me with a complaint of hoarseness. The hoarseness was only for two weeks. He was a farmer by occupation with no known addictions uh, be it alcohol or tobacco. On laryngoscopy, it was revealed he had a white mouse nibbled appearance over both his vocal cord. A biopsy and histopathological examination after some time revealed the lesion to be a fungal infection, aspergillosis. The patient is much better now after he underwent surgery and is on antifungals. Now, since he was 60 year old, a non-smoker and non-alcoholic, and his symptoms of hoarseness was only for two weeks, the white patch or leukoplakia, which is often considered benign, could have been easily left alone to be observed conservatively. But since steam inhalation, voice rest and conservative measures fail to provide any sort of improvement, The radiological and endoscopic follow-up made us sure that a biopsy was needed quickly. The patient was cooperative and followed through with the treatment. That's the reason why after a month of treatment, the patient almost has a normal voice. That's a part of being a doctor which is the toughest. Even when people want to be helped, the work starts with them. If somebody really wants to get better, they have to take the initiative to follow through with the treatment. Work on you. That's the part which is most important. The work on us, ourselves. Doctor, heal thyself. So right now, I have to go and take some more steam so that my voice is better. This was Dr. Amrita and you are listening to the Health Wellbridge Podcast.